Na mlicha ya Rais Uhuru Kenyatta kuonekana kukubali kwamba upo mkataba wa kuagiza sukari kutoka taifa la Uganda. Waziri wa Masala ya nje bi Amina Mohamed na katibu wa Wizara Karanja Kibicho wameshikilia msimamo kwamba hakuna mkataba uliotoa sahihi kati ya taifa la Kenya na taifa la Uganda. Muungano wa kodi kwa upande wake wamedai kwamba mkataba huo ni wa kuongeza ufukara zaidi kwa wakulima wa mio wa humu nchini. Francis Mtalaki na maelezo zaidi. Kitendawili cha mkataba wa kuagiza sukari kutoka nchini Uganda sasa kinaonekana kuchukua mkondo tofauti na pengine kinahitaji mji. Where do you want us to get our shortfall from? I would rather get it from Uganda than from Brazil. Usemi huu kutoka kwa rais mwenyewe wikijana ni tofauti kabisa na ile ngoma anayocheza waziri wake wa mambo ya nje Amina Muhammad sawa na katibu wake katika wizara hiyo. If a deal was signed, if there was an instrument that was signed, then we would not be discussing this the instrument would be out already. Right? It would already be in the media. Okay? Uh, there's no instrument that was signed. No instrument was signed on sugar. None. I am here looking in the eye telling you I never prepared an agreement like that. I don't know which this agreement is. In fact, just the other day I challenged someone. I'll give you 500,000 shillings if you come with a copy of an agreement that was signed. Matamshi haya eliyoja utata kutoka serikalini ya naibuwa swali nyeti la kutakujua anayusema ukweli. Discussions were held on all the commodities that we exchange, right? All the commodities that are exported out of Kenya, right, into Uganda, and those that are exported out of Uganda into into Kenya. Lakini katika upande wa pili, cheche za maneno na siyasa kusia na mkataba huo zimeingia katika upeo wa juu. Walioko katika upinzani, sasa wanaonekana kukero na sirikali na wanaitaka kueka mambo hadharani. Kenyans will have to demand for answers as to the exact nature of the deal concerning the milk exports. Yes, Kenyan sugar is expensive, but it feeds Kenyan farmers and it educates the children of the sugar cane farmers. Yes, Ugandan sugar is cheap, but it only feeds Ugandan farmers and their children. No nation ever developed by abandoning its products. Wameisuta serikali na kusema kuwa wanawakandamiza wa kulima wa miwa ambao mapato yao ni ya chini na uamuzi huo wa uhuru Kenyatta ukiwa ni ukweli utawasambaratisha kwa hali na mali. Seneta Bitrese Lachi akiwa huko Kisi ameutaka upinzani kuheshimu mkataba wa jumu ya Afrika Mashariki kuangazia masuala ya kuboresha ukulima wa miwa hasa magharibi mwa Kenya badala ya siasa na kwamba Kenya imekuwa ikiagiza sukari kutoka Uganda miaka miwili iliyopita wakati imefika tujue ya kwamba kura yetu haitachezewa na kila mwanasiasa na sukari si ndio mwisho wa maisha ni lazima tutasimama kama watu wa western tusuhulishe shida yetu hiyo ya sukari tuelemishe mkulima je kati ya rais Uhuru Kenyatta na waziri Amina Muhammad ni nani msema ukweli na iwapo mbivu na mbichi tutaifahamu hapo kesho mbona serikali ikachukua muda na kukaribisha cheche za maneno na joto la kisiasa kiasi hichi Francis Mtalaki Kaitian leo